Today, we're getting the scoop on what's coming down the pipeline for Samsung Galaxy devices. The talk of the town is the upcoming Android 15 update, and with Samsung's One UI 7 on top of that, many Galaxy users are eager to know if their phone will be making the jump. Let's dive in and see what we can uncover. First off, it's important to manage expectations. Google's busy putting the finishing touches on Android 15 by July, but that's just the first step. Samsung then needs to integrate it with their One UI 7 update, which takes additional time. So, Galaxy owners will have to wait a few months before experiencing the new software firsthand. A way to find out if your phone is compatible. Not required. While the official list from Samsung won't be available until after the release, we can leverage past update trends to make a solid prediction. All right, let's get down to business. Here are the Galaxy devices that are strong contenders for receiving the Android 15. One UI 7 update. Galaxy S series. This is Samsung's flagship line, so you can expect to see recent models on the list. We're talking about the S24 Ultra, S24 Plus, and S24, along with the S23 Series Ultra Plus Standard and FE. Going back a bit further, the S22 Series Ultra Plus and Standard, and even the S21 lineup, FE, Ultra, Plus, and Standard, are likely in the clear. Galaxy Z Series. Samsung's foldable phones are gaining serious traction, and recent Z Series devices are strong candidates. The Z Fold 6, D Fold 5, Z Flip 6, and Z Flip 5 are on the radar. The Z Fold 4, Z Flip 4, Z Fold 3, and Z Flip 3 shouldn't be left out either. Beyond flagships, A Series, F Series, and M Series, the good news extends to mid range Galaxy phones. Devices like the A73, A55, A54, A53, A35, A34, and A33 from the A Series have a good chance. Even the A25, A24, and A23 are strong possibilities, along with the A15, LTE, and 5G, and A14, LTE, and 5G. If you have a Galaxy F-Series phone like the F55, F54, F34, or F15, you might be in luck. The same goes for the M-Series with the M55, M54, M34, M53, M33, and M15 potentially on the list. There's a method to the madness when it comes to this prediction. Typically, any Galaxy phone that launched with Android 13 is likely to get bumped up to Android 15. That's because Samsung generally offers at least two major OS upgrades for most devices. Additionally, flagships and mid-range phones that were promised four years of updates, meaning they launched with Android 11 or higher, are also on good footing for receiving Android 15. Lastly, any brand new Galaxy phones or tablets that hit the market in 2024 are pretty much guaranteed to get Android 15. It's important to remember that this list isn't set in stone. The official confirmation from Samsung might not arrive until August or September. But hey, that's why we're here. We'll keep you posted on any changes, so be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay informed. In the meantime, let's hear from you in the comments below. Which Galaxy device are you rocking? And are you hyped about the prospect of Android 15? One UI 7, we'll catch you in the next video. Today, we are diving into the latest buzz surrounding the upcoming Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. Buckle up, because this phone is shaping up to be a true game changer in the world of smartphones. Let's get into the juicy details. First off, Samsung seems laser focused on making the S25 Ultra the king of smartphones in 2025. The company appears to be using a two-pronged attack to achieve this, a monstrous camera system and mind-blowing performance upgrades. Let's start with the camera. The Galaxy S25 Ultra is expected to stick with its familiar quad camera setup, but with some serious enhancements. The main sensor will likely boast a hopping 200 megapixels, matching the S24 Ultra but optimized for the S25 Ultra's specific hardware thanks to the new Snapdragon Agent 4 camera ISP. But that's not all. We're also looking at a 5x optical zoom lens with a 50 megapixel sensor, a brand new 3x optical zoom lens also with a 50 megapixel sensor and an ultra wide angle lens getting a bump to 50 megapixels as well. These upgrades, particularly for the 3X zoom and ultra wide sensors are long overdue and promise to significantly elevate mobile photography. Now let's talk about performance. One of the most exciting rumors is the reintroduction of a fan favorite feature, a 16 gigabytes RAM option, and not just any RAM, but the industry first LPDDR5X RAM, capable of speeds up to a staggering 10.7 GEPs. This translates to unparalleled performance for on-device AI, demanding tasks like cloud gaming, and much more. When you combine this insane RAM with the power of the Snapdragon Agent 4 processor, the S25 Ultra has the potential to be the absolute performance leader in the smartphone world. 
Speaking of the Agent 4, another reliable leak suggests it'll house the most powerful GPU ever seen in a smartphone. Benchmarks show prototypes running Genshin Impact at a smooth 1080 resolution and 60 FPS. A dream for mobile gamers. Currently, this popular game is capped at 720 on most phones and maintaining a consistent 60 FPS is a struggle. Of course, with great power comes a potentially higher price tag. Rumors suggest this Snapdragon Agent 4 chip could inflate the price of the entire S25 series compared to its predecessor. Qualcomm has reportedly increased the cost of the Agent 4 significantly compared to the Agent 3. This leaves Samsung with a tough choice, raise prices across the board or potentially use the Exynos 2500 processor for the S25 and S25 Plus, reserving the mighty Agent 4 exclusively for the S25 Ultra. The Agent 4 itself is a whole new beast, Built from the ground up using Qualcomm's Super Orion cores previously seen in their laptops, this chip has the potential to give the Galaxy S25 Ultra performance that rivals some Apple M-series laptops. But wait, there's more! We also have hot rumors about the Galaxy S25 Ultra being equipped with the next generation of storage, UFS 4.1. Universal Flash Storage, or UFS, determines how fast your phone can access and store data. The latest and greatest version is UFS 4.0 which powers many current flagships, including the Galaxy S24. But the future is calling and whispers suggest the Galaxy S25 Ultra might be the first to sport UFS 4.1. While UFS 5.0 is expected around 2027, UFS 4.1 steps in as a minor yet significant upgrade. It's not a mind-blowing jump in raw numbers, but it's targeted to enhance specific areas like on-device AI features. Faster read and write speeds with UFS 4.1 will allow the phone to access data needed by AI algorithms much quicker, translating to smoother performance for features like scene optimization in your camera app, real-time language translation, and other background AI functions. So, what does this all mean? The Galaxy S25 Ultra, if equipped with UFS 4.1, is shaping up to be a powerhouse for AI enthusiasts. Faster data access, improved multitasking, and potential battery life improvements. That's a recipe for a future-proof phone ready to tackle demanding tasks. Of course, this is all based on rumors for now, but one thing's for sure, the future of smartphones looks increasingly intertwined with the power of AI, and the Galaxy S25 Ultra, with its potential UFS 4.1 upgrade, might just be at the forefront of that exciting evolution. So there you have it! What are your thoughts on the upcoming S25 Ultra? Are the camera upgrades exciting you? Can't wait for the return of 16GB RAM? Or is the potential power of the Snapdragon Agent 4 blowing your mind? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in. I will see you in the next one, guys. Until then, goodbye.